Crimson, going up Burnley Road towards Honcote. We have now turned into Bolton Avenue and heading down a piece of tarmac owned by Lancashire County Council and the upkeep is with them as well. I'm trying my best to avoid the larger potholes but due to road layout I'm unable to do this. The camera stabilisation makes the road not appear as, as severe as it is. the Huncoe's Business Park, home to many local companies, from furniture manufacturers, furniture distributors, transformer manufacturers, and even a recycling company. There's also brickworks hiding behind the Benton Bird unit as well. This is one of the smaller wagons that probably uses the road. It tops out 20, 24 tonnes, but we do have brick wagons that use the same road. And Six axles. Here we are at the top of Bolton Avenue. As you can see, the tarmac is deformed due to the amount of heavy traffic using it. Uh, the road is failing, the foundations are failing in it, there's potholes appearing in it. These potholes will actually meet the criteria laid down by Lancaster County Council. Again, we can see that all the tarmac is cracking, time expired. We can see some patches have been applied in the, in the past, and even some of the only recently. We can also see pieces of tarmac on the pavement, which has been kicked up from vehicles using the tarmac. As you can see, the furrows were wore into this piece of tarmac. We're now opposite Bramberg's Drive. As you can see, the potholes here, which are in badly need of repairing, but the whole road is in a bad condition. Again, we have patches that have been placed recently. Next, a piece of tarmac that which has also been replaced at the same time. Here is one that's done very recently, and you've done a small patch. And again, net right next to it, there's parts of tarmac which the time expired, cracking and endangers the need of attention. Cars do travel down here about 30 mile an hour. Some travel slower than, than others due to the conditions, some by the car suspension. As you can see, this is one of the largest type of vehicles used this road. This is a brake wagon that's come from, from the African The uphill section doesn't appear to be as bad as the downhill section, but again, it's a subject to the same wear. now made our way a bit further back up Bolton Avenue as you can see there really is deep ruts starting to appear in this section of road it won't be long before vehicles have to stop using this road due to condition of it again this is one of the patches you placed recently and they also the part next to it should have been replaced at the same time you know so your repair is really a waste of money That's a bad example of a road. This is one of the better examples of Lancashire County Council's work. Here, the road was not in such a bad condition as Bolton Avenue, but look, it's like a billiard table. It's smooth, easy to drive on, no danger of falling down a pothole and damage the car suspension. You know, it really is it's a chalk and cheese difference between the Bolton Avenue's highly used and this highly used country road. 
which is in Haslin Road, running between Haslingdon and Blackman. You know, the no consistency in the work carried out. 